This is Jeremy from Reverb.com and today we're going to talk about using sub-octave bass pedals and how they can expand your sound palette. A lot of modern music doesn't actually have a bass guitar in it at all. It's got keyboards, synths, whatever, and using a sub-octave bass pedal in combination with a few other basics can really help you expand your sound and get into some really unique electronic textures. So for this first example, we're going to talk about how to get a sort of kind of 808-ish sort of rap inspired sound. So we're using a uh, Boss OC3 or uh, you can also use an OC2. This is the sound with the pedal off. Now I'm gonna turn the pedal on, but if you turn the direct level all the way off, you get this really kind of unique electronic uh, unnatural sound. And you also want to be sure that you have the second sub octave all the way off because it's just too low. You can add a little bit of distortion. Here we have an Aguilar Agro pedal, but really any you know, bass focused drive will do. And if you want to get extra subby, we have this bass equalizer. Um, just to kind of roll off the high end, you could do this on your amp as well. So now if you wanted to get into a more sort of Stevie Wonder inspired Moog approach kind of sound, um, we, we've switched up our, our pedals a little bit. We're gonna still use the, the Boss OC3, and now we're gonna use an MXR uh, bass envelope filter. Uh, you can really use any envelope filter here. So if you want to just get playing crazy, you can do things like add a tremolo pedal or a phase pedal and get some really kind of wild dance sounds. So we've got the OC3 to start things off. We've got a little distortion dialed in and a little bit of direct sound. So that's good bass sound. And then we can use this Tremotron. Get a little weird. then add envelope filter. What that's doing is the Tremotron is triggering the envelope filter at, at the rate we have set. I hope you've enjoyed this taste into sub-octave bass pedals. Obviously, there's a ton of choices out there. There's a bunch of different flavors for each of these pedals. There's a lot of different combinations you can use. So go ahead and explore. Thanks.